All right, we've had some questions about the new preferred parking here at Disneyland. So just to get a quick look, they've stopped parking here on the roof of Making Friends, but you can kind of see how it works. There's this designated area here, which takes up just kind of a corner. It's also all the handicapped parking as well. And then you can see all the rest of the parking is the entire rest of the floor. But basically you pay your $35. And that guy cut right through the uh, blocked off area there. Uh, but basically they keep a cast member up here as long as they're parking people. You pull up to that front area, obviously letting people go, letting the parking attendants know as you go along the way. And uh, yeah, you park right up here, whether it's disabled or preferred. Preferred parking is $35. You can tack it on if you have annual pass parking. You can just tack on that extra cash there, what is it, like 17 bucks, I think, and make your way up to this area. But for the most part, we're not seeing it being too widely used. It's mostly been disabled parking on the floor. I'd say this has been pretty standard from what we've seen, not to say that this is the standard for every day, just as we've kind of checked it out. It's been this site, so it'd be probably irritating if you were, uh, you know, paying for the preferred parking and could have been one of these spots right close because it's not not obviously that big of a difference from being in this group. That said, where I'm parked right now is way on the other side over there, so uh, I wouldn't have paid for the preferred parking anyway, but it would have been a consideration, I guess, because I have probably the worst in the group of the worst possible parking uh, for the top floor. So the preferred parking goes throughout the day and is constantly an option, so you can check it out. All right, until next time, see you in line somewhere.